How's it guys? It's Danny from the BSV Game Show, and today we're bringing you a little different of a video. Uh, hopefully, my mic's looking at this way. I'm gonna go and check out the new um, updated Ascension things because if I find on the, I think it's up here or here. If I look in the patch notes, it actually says that um, there you go. Temporarily increase the drop rate slightly of the keystones in the Order Ascension dungeon. So I'm gonna test out this little. Oh no, hello. This little. Um, improved drop rate supposedly and look RS3 so I'm probably gonna go here for about an hour and then see the uh, loots that I get um, I'd either kill the Rorarius which are all here and it's empty so I'm probably gonna kill them here or I'm gonna go and kill, kill the Gladius I usually get one key an hour so if I get more than one key um, it's gonna be profit so yeah uh, ooh recording little symbol so yeah let's see how this is gonna go Look at this, literally like three minutes in. Well, not even that, like a minute in, I get a keystone. So, that's pretty awesome. So, if I could just eat this food, take this keystone, and we shall continue on to see uh, how lucky I actually get at this place. Okay, so I'm about ten minutes in now, and um, I'd say I've prob probably made about 50k in Runite limbs. Like, they drop an hour food. But the little green ones. I mean, look at that. Jesus Christ, I bet this one drops one now. I told you, look at that. They just absolutely drop them. How much are these actually worth? Why don't we... Okay, I'll check them in a second. But yeah, you you get so many green items from these. It's uh, ooh, nice life. It's incredible. But um, no more keystones at the minute. It seems so. Um, like I can't say. Really? Jesus Christ. I can't really say anything at the moment, um, but I do feel like there is more. They like, they, dro they drop more uh, keystone pieces. I feel, and I'm gonna get another one. I think by the end of the hour. Like if I get one on the third, uh, like third minute in, it's gonna be a pretty good, uh, pretty good trip. I can almost foresee that. So hopefully, it and there we go. Nice little uh, second key. Funnily enough, Secundus again. So. This is about 15 minutes in, and I'm just getting absolutely torn by these guys. So I'm just going to switch my prayers real quick. Alright, so two keys down. Uh, just pick this one up before I forget it. Um, so yeah, it's already an improved drop rate. After 20 minutes, I've got all of these. Um, well, I say all of these. All of these two keys, anyway. Um, yeah, it's definitely increased uh, noticeably. Uh, this will affect the price, I'm guaranteeing it'll affect the price. Like, I'll go the GE. And I either sell these quite low or won't be able to sell them at all. But it's cool that um, they're opening up the option for people to get Ascension Crossbows. Because it's either you buy them or you kill every single boss in this dungeon. Because you can't buy the Signets to make it. You literally have to go an all or nothing approach. So, yeah, let's keep on going and see how this goes. Okay, so funny story. I get um, a drop later and it was a potato with butter. I was thinking, oh, um... I need to take potato with butter because I need some healing. Uh, well, that's awkward. Okay, so I can't heal, but um, I'm guessing that's a rare drop table drop. I mean, it's not exactly the best drop ever, but that's random. And no, I don't want to tank. Um, yeah, that's really, really weird. Um... Oh, I thought there was another one then, but it's Divine Tears. Damn it, these are the most pointless thing in the game at the moment. It makes... Uh, oh, wow, prayer drops. It fools me so much times. Alright, let's keep it going. Picking up all these potatoes with butter now, just in case. Look at it. 50 potatoes with butter. butter. Okay, so I might be stupid here. Um, and it may be a common drop or something, like an uncommon drop from these guys. I got it again. I got another 50 potatoes. Like, I'm just really confused at the moment because you'll get potatoes like this, and they'll be on the ground, they're just chilling, and you get one. And then you see a potato, but it's like, oh, I'll get another one. And then it's 50 noted. Now, I don't really. <laughs> you'll have to comment in the comments whether this is actually, like, um, rare or something. Because I'm really confused. If this is rare, I've just got it twice, like, in the space of five minutes. And not that. Oh, look, see. Not that I wouldn't want it because it it keeps me um, it keeps me here, but it's just really weird to see a hundred potatoes with butter noted in my inventory. Uh, I just don't know. 
Alright guys, and now about, um, I'd say probably 25 minutes in, I've got my third keystone. It's a Primus keystone. So, that's pretty cool. The fact that I've got three keystones now, um, uh, in 20 minutes, shows that the drop rates have improved quite a bit because I'm getting them up the ass What? Really? Really? Damn it, just pick these up again. Just look at my inventory, just look how many you get, roughly. It's insane. You just, I've got 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10. I've got 12 runite limbs. I'm going to bring some nature runes next time. You know, just get some uh, out on the go. Fuck. I forgot I'm on ancients from the next. God damn it. Well, let's keep going anyway. Alright, so guys, this is just going to be the um, the last kill. I've done about half an hour. I've done about half an hour now. Um, I'm just going to go and cook some dinner. And then I'll come back and do the final half hour. So far, yeah, I've got uh, three keystone pieces. Um, so yeah, it seems to be a um, increased drop. Um, yeah, so pretty much, I'll just finish this up when I have my dinner. Bye. Also, this um, because I'm not too sure on the button to pause. Like you see here, it says record and stop. I don't know if there's a button to pause. And with RS3, it takes up the entirety of the screen. And I don't have two screens, so yeah, I have to keep bringing this back up. So, I apologize. I'll try and sort something out for the next video, but yeah. So, din din. Alright, so I'm back. So that was some damn good chicken. I had like a, a chicken stir fry. But anyway, back on to the point of this video. I'm going to try and um, kill these guys for another half hour. I'm probably going to rebank. Look at all these rune limbs. Uh, and then I'll be back here, so yeah. Boop. Alright, so about three minutes after I get back and after having a conversation with my brother, I get another keystone. Ascension keystone quarter, so that is four in roughly 35 minutes. So yeah, I, I can definitely say um, this episode of Rune... I'm, I'm actually going to call this title RuneScape Test Lab, so what I might do is um, start it at the start, like, hey, this is uh, Danny from the PS3 Game Show, and welcome to RuneScape Test Labs or something, because I think that's quite a good, good name. So yeah, I'm going to start a new series now called Runescape Test Labs. I'm going to test um, recent patches on certain things and see how they are, see how they affect. Yeah, that sounds like a cool idea. Anyway, that's killing these. Okay, so funny story about this one. Um, my computer was freezing, like it started, um, the screen just stopped, uh, everything wouldn't work, my cats wouldn't work, Skype wouldn't work. So I thought, oh, I better um, save the project that I've got going. Uh, because I don't want to lose like seven minutes of footage just because my computer's been cool. So I decided to save and it was saving, it was taking a little bit. And then while I did it, I got this. I got the Keystone Quintus. So I still have 15 minutes left and I've got five keys. And while I was um, just killing these guys, watching the original video, I um, remember saying that I'll be lucky if I get more than one. Like if I get two, I've got five. <laughs> so yeah, I feel really lucky this time. And hopefully the 15 minutes should bring me another two at this rate, so I should finish with seven. And yeah, I'll then give a brief overview of the um, the test. I am with 10 minutes to go. Can you guess which key it is? <gasps> Bet you didn't guess Sextus. Oh yeah. Let's see if this potato with butter is in a, on its own. Yeah, I also got 55 and noted one, so yeah. Keep coming up for the last 10 minutes. And there we go guys, another one. Look, where is it? I think it's under me now. Where the hell is it? Oh yeah. Keystone Primus. Oh yeah. Okay, so that is the hour of um Runescape Test Labs for this one. And um, this episode is now finished. So before the update, um, I was averaging about one, maybe two keys an hour. Um, the update said it would increase the drop rate temporarily of the keystones in the Order of Ascension dungeon, and they were not wrong. I got seven in this one hour, um, and I wasn't even really killing that fast. I was doing some like sort of AFK kills. I was doing some like try hard kills. So I averaged out to be average kills throughout the thing. I ended up getting 150 noted potato with butters and they ended up getting 21 runite limbs which themselves are how much? 200k 
So if we just want to price check everything, they're not going to be worth much, but I just thought that was funny. Uh, it totals up to around 3.5 mil in an hour, which isn't too bad. Now, these probably aren't going to sell for this price. In fact, if we take a screen, well, if we take a look at that, 3591141, and then I'll show the total cash after selling them. And let's see the difference in them. Okay, so after selling all that, it actually turns out that I made a little bit of profit. Um, they sold for a little bit more than the mid price on the GE, and I managed to get 4.1 mil in this hour from it. So it is quite good money. But the main reason of this video was to test the update um, to see how much significant it was, like how much significant of a difference. And I'd say it's nearly 250% difference. Like, it's at least double the keystones every hour, I'd say. Um, obviously this is a small sample size and to prove it like definitively I'll have to do much bigger sample size which for this profits per hour I wouldn't mind doing but yeah um, it seems that you make a lot of money it seems that <coughs> the update is very substantial like it's a massive change from what it was and I really enjoy it so I hope this episode has been really informative don't forget to comment like and subscribe the video and I've been great and also I will fix this being in the bottom corner for the next video, I promise. Thanks, bye.